Hello and welcome to Pie and Cake, Pie and Cake Football's second episode of commentary here. We have just released this time. Um, our last episode we had Manchester United, Bolton, or as I should say, Bolton versus Manchester United at the Reebok Stadium, Manchester United, winning 5 now on that one. Just the goals, and then a video of um, the best parts of our commentary through the game and the goals. Here we have in our second episode it Pjolk versus Tottenham in the Europa League. It's already six minutes gone in the game and uh, Tottenham has got a less strength side out in the Europa League. He is resting a lot of big name players for that game. Only, only sort of first team players in the side a Bassong Luca and Pavlichenko, but it is Eto with the ball in? It is Pavo and it's blocked, but he's still going. No, it's cleared by Basson, and now Giovanni has the ball for Tottenham Hotspur, and it's put up to Pavlichenko. Pavlichenko now has the ball for Tottenham, just outside the box now. He puts the ball through to Do Dos Santos. He looked like he may have been taken off the ball there, muscled off the ball. The referee. Didn't say any foul there. Here's the earlier chance. Eto with the ball in a sh first time shot. Well, not very mostly balanced there for who had the shot there, but it wasn't the best there from him. A youngster Carroll for Tottenham. Here is Kane and Kane is taken out. Here is Livermore for Tottenham. Livermore, can he? It's oh, and it's. Shot off the line, it was Livermore. Livermore, Carroll with the shot. And a defensive block off the line for for Bjork. And Tottenham, unfortunate, and maybe should be in front in the 11th minute of the game here at Bjork. No, now Walker, Carl Walker on the ball now, puts the ball in. And not a very good cross at all. And it's out straight away, Sapagidis. Here is Eto on the right side for Pjolk. And it's a good interception there by Basson Kane. And it, it's now Townsend in the middle of the park. Livermore gets a challenge there. There's a foul. Number 85, Arias. Here is Townsend with the ball in from the left side. It's headed out by the Pjolk defence. Headed onwards, but Eto collects. That's been quite good so far. It's Freelina for a shot just outside the box. It took a deflection. Not sure who it was off for. I think it could be a corner. Well, bloody hell, the fans are going mental in the crowd. There's hardly any shirts being worn in the crowd at Pioak Stadium. And they're going mental. Is it nil nil? And well, what fans they have there in uh, Pioak. 18 minutes gone. It's a corner to Pioak. Deflection off of. The Tottenham defender, probably. And the ball's been put in by Garcia. And, wow, is bending. Kudicini manages to get it in his grasp. Here is Carl Walker on the ball now. Being booed by the Pioke fans on the right side. What's he going to do with it here? He's going to lose the ball. Garcia gets the ball back. Here is Spurpidius, but... Not a good through ball. Vian Hat. Now Selpegidis. Selpegidis. To Vian Ha. Vian Ha is inside the box. The ball is put in. He just got inside the box. Just outside the six yard box on the right side. You thought he was going to go for the shot. He went for the cross, and in the end, the cross was too long. And, um, well, Pioke, first real chance there, I think. Other than that through ball that went through to Cudicini earlier on. That was their first real chance to get a shot on goal. Sadly, the cross wasn't the best. Townsend on the ball. Townsend on the left side. Going to cross the ball in. It's luckily deflected out. But it's Giovanni with Dos Santos with a shot. A very light shot there. And it's uh, just it's on the right side of the box now. It's headed in by Kane. And the first chance for Tottenham. First real chance on goal. And um, 
A lovely cross by, I think it was Carl Walker. His earlier cross, it wasn't, his earlier cross wasn't the best. Earlier on, but this time, he got the cross just right, but the header, in the end, straight to the goalkeeper, but the first chance. And Kudicini comes out, and the referee has given a penalty to Pioch. It is a yellow card for Kudicini. He's come out here. He's a little bit late coming off his line, Kudicini. It is a yellow card for him. He takes out the number 33 player for Pioch. I'm just going to find out for you who it is. Sorry, I haven't got my lineups up at the moment. But he comes out and he, his glo both gloves latch on to the player's foot. He is tripped over. And the player has gone over and the referee has called for a penalty straight away. And lifts the yellow card up for Claudio Cudicini. So Tottenham in the next minute could go down one goal to nil Pioke it is Leno with the penalty Leno takes the penalty he smashes it into the top left corner Leno for Pioke the party can well the party's already started even though it was nil nil but the party can rave on here at the Pioke stadium in the 31st minute Pioke score the penalty okay sorry the goal does not count. Pioke players were already in the box when the. Let's have a look. Okay, I think the goalkeeper wasn't on the line. Not. I don't think that should matter. I think it was players already in the box when the uh, f penalty was taken. So Lilio has to try and reach that top corner once again. So Lilio with the penalty, and he misses this time. The P.O. player has missed here. And Tottenham. Life is saved by the referee. So at one end. There was a, a definite penalty call. At the other end. Yes it was a definite penalty call. He scored the penalty. The referee disallowed it because the goalkeeper wasn't on the line. And maybe... Pioke players already in the box when the penalty was taken. Penalty had to be taken again. Penalty missed by Linio. And a ball is through. A shot on goal. And luckily it didn't go through Kudicini's legs. Alfana had the uh, shot. And um, maybe an easy take up there. It was a lofted through ball by Salbegidis. A quality lofted through ball. It's chested down. First time shot. In the box and Cudicini with a comfortable save. The one minute of stoppage time has now gone. And it is half time here. We begin the second half here. Pioca Tottenham. And Saltagidis. Saltagidis runs into the box. Maybe puts it too long. And if somebody was there that could have gone into the back of the net. But luckily Carl Jordan was there for Tottenham. And he's been fouled. Very cynically there by Afana. And the referee has given a fan a yellow card. And we just got news through. Dynamo Kiev are losing 1 0 to another English team, Stoke City. And it is former Birmingham man, former Birmingham man, um, Jerome. Here's a shot by Falke. Oh, and it just goes past the left post. Pavlichenko was battling with the keeper. As the cross came over, battling with the keeper, and the keeper decided to go back to his position. And Falke, here we go, is Pavlichenko, keeper battles with him. And now he can't go outside the box because otherwise he could handball it. He passes it to Falke, Falke runs just outside the box, and he, he takes the shot. Which, well, to me, looked like he did have a flexion, so it should have been maybe a Tottenham corner. But it was. Um, curled and it just went past the left post sadly for Tottenham here is Federix on the right side Federix still on the ball, Federix still going Federix gets tripped, referee gives nothing, the ball's been put in here's Pavlichenko inside the box here is Carroll it's crossed in, a header, it's hit the bar and it was 
in it. She can't believe that it hasn't gone in. Lino with another ball in. Headed out by Basong and it's a corner for Bapiok. Townsend and Townsend has apparently been fouled. Full time here in Piok.